Welcome back to the Brute Tangs, I'm Moses Zillitz, where today I'm going to be making a blueberry hydromel. Let's get started. Today we're going to use fresh star sands, 9 pounds of wildflower honey, 7 pounds of blueberries, 1 5 gallon bucket, 4 and a half gallons of spring water, safe LSO4, go firm, cheap vodka or sterile boiled water if you prefer, measuring cup, measuring spoons, and our yeast pitching bowl. Side note, one way to prep your fruit is to freeze it the day before, then thaw it out on the day you're ready to make some mead. Let's prepare our area for mead making. As always, don't forget to sanitize. Now before we pour our water into the bucket, we're going to reserve two cups off to the side and get it warm in our microwave. Today we're going to use Safe LSO4 and we're going to sprinkle in some GoFirm for hydration. Once we've emptied the rest of our water into the bucket, let's grab our honey from the sink and get ready for our honey shot. Give it a good stir. Now we drop in our blueberries and give them a mash down and another stir. Now we say our yarkalk and pitch. Okay, after pitching is done, I'll give it one last stir. Okay, let's take a reading from our hydrometer. Looks like we're at 1.06, so we're going to get an ABV of about 7.8 to 8% given the fruit juice. This will go dry given the tolerance of our yeast, so we are going to stabilize and back sweeten later on. Then we hit down the lid, insert the airlock, and fill up with your choice of vodka or sanitized water. And that's all folks. I'm hoping the ferment goes well and we have a tasty blueberry hydromel. Feel free to share your experience with hydromels in the comments below. And as always, if you like my videos and want to see more, then hit the subscribe button and I'll see you next time. Cheers.